Hey everyone, it's Heather here from A Power Design, back at you with another episode of Pick the Pink. Can you believe that we've had this many different pink filaments? I can't believe it either. These prints were actually sent to me from Scott over at Arcania's workshop. You guys may have seen him on Twitter uh, at Arcania. And he sent me these pink prints a while back, but I wanted to include them in this series uh, because it's a different pink than any pink that I had. And I, it's a different filament than I had. So let's talk about the filament. So these prints are from Fox Smart, and this is a PLA filament. You can see Fox Smart PLA at their website, foxsmart.com. This filament can also be purchased on Amazon as well. Now, the big thing about Fox Smart filaments is that they are very inexpensive. And after speaking with Scott and things like that, he told me that this is one of his favorite filaments to use because it always prints very, very well. The color is awesome and it's so inexpensive. It's so reasonable. So their filaments run anywhere from 14 to $16 for a one kilogram spool. Uh, they do also offer half spools. So 500 gram spools for less. Uh, they offer a flat shipping rate. Uh, the big caveat though is they only ship to the United States. Uh, so let's take a look at the prints. So I didn't print a maker coin with it because I didn't have the filament, but Scott printed his. This is Arcania's workshop, his maker coin. And uh, it's great. I mean, this color is really cool. It's, it's a really nice pink color. Not really like a baby pink, um, just a really pretty pink. Uh, and he printed this rose and I mean, the filament looks great. It doesn't have a whole lot of stringing. It doesn't, uh, you know, have a whole lot of imperfections or anything like that on the prints. They're really, they really turned out really nice. I know that he has a couple of different printers. I think these were probably printed on his Robo 3D printer. And then the last thing was this tea light holder. And I'll show you guys, I have some close-ups of it with the light. I have lights in it uh, and it lights up and it's just really, really cool. The bottom layer is amazing. And for such an inexpensive filament, it's just amazing to me the results that, that he was able to consistently get with something that's this inexpensive. Um, and I know inexpensive filaments you can find almost anywhere, but when you're purchasing such an inexpensive filament, it's, you know, you wonder, okay, is this filament going to be good? Is it going to be okay? Do I even really want to use something that only cost me $14? Is it going to be worth it? I don't want my prints to look like crap. And, you know, I think this was a testament that it is. And, and after researching Fox Smart a little bit, I mean, they have tons and tons of reviews and showing how great their filament is and, and how it stacks up to some of the more expensive filaments out there. So it's definitely worth it to take a look at their website and see what sorts of things they offer. Uh, maybe even especially if you're doing just a bunch of prototype printing or, you know, you want to make sure that you have something that's inexpensive if you're doing a lot massive printing or things like that. I think this would be a great filament to utilize in schools because of its inexpensive price point. I think, and, it, and it's reliability of printing as well. So yeah, definitely check them out. And that's it for this episode of Pick the Pink. We're almost done. Tune in tomorrow to see what pink I pick next.